This is Brian Putt. Today's video is about installing the SIPMath toolbar. If you want to get started with SIPMath, we first need to install the toolbar. We'll need to go to www.probabilitymanagement.org, select the tool tab, and download the toolbar. And what we should find is a toolbar on Excel that looks something like this. And we can download either the Windows version or the Mac version. Here's what it looks like on my PC. It shows in Excel the typical file, home, so forth. And then over here on the right it says SIPMath Modeler Tools. And then it shows the number of icons here as shown. We're not going to talk about what those icons do. Probabilitymanagement.org has little videos on each one of those icons. We're just going to talk about installing it. So now let me demonstrate how to install the SIPMath toolbar on my Excel. So we'll see here that we do not have the SIPMath toolbar shown. So what we need to do is install it. And we'll do that by going over to probabilitymanagement.org. So the website today looks like this. And we're going to see down here it says download free free new 3.0 toolbar. So we're going to click on that. And here's a couple little videos and we're going to download the Windows version. And it wants me to log on so I'll let you log on. Do a new registration. And after logging in it'll say your download should begin momentarily. You can see it's downloading. Mine's running a security scan and then I'm going to tell it to run and then here it says welcome to the SIPMath tools so we'll say next probability management I agree and now the default directory is C program files x86 we're going to need to remember that so we'll just keep leave it at the default and say next and we'll say install and it's completed. We'll say finish. So let's go back over to our Excel. I'm going to close down Excel and lock and go back into it again. We'll do a blank worksheet. And you'll notice that we do not have the SIPMath toolbar. And that's because although it downloaded the toolbar, it didn't actually install it in Excel. To do that, we're going to go to File, Options, Add-ins, and then down here we're going to go Manage Excel Add-ins, Go, and we want to look for the SIPMath Modeler Tools. Let's assume these two didn't exist, and what we're going to need to do is go Browse, and we're going to go to my local drive C, program user files, and then we're going to go down to SIP math. And there we see the SIP math tools 3.1.58. We'll click on that and we'll say OK. In this case, the toolbar already existed. Do you want to replace it? We'll say yes. And now it has checked the SIPMath Modeler Tools 3.1.58. That's the current version. Yours may say something higher than that. And we'll say OK. And now you'll notice that we have the SIPMath Modeler Toolbar up here. So to recap, after we've downloaded the SIPMath Toolbar, we go to File, Options, Add-ins, Add-ins Go, we'll browse for the toolbar, we want to go to our C drive, Program Files 86, SIPMath, and click on the 3.1.58 or some other number there for the SIPMath Modeler Tools. And then we want to return to the add-ins to make sure that the SIPMath Modeler Tools 3.1.58 is installed. If you want to get more information about the SIPMath modeler tools, 
visit probabilitymanagement.org. There's a lot of videos on that site. You can browse through the book, The Flaw of Averages by Sam Savage. And you can contact me, Brian Putt, through LinkedIn or brian at theputts.com. And I can send you some additional information. Thank you for watching.